In this video, I'm going to show you how to install a TS-8 mounting panel in the rearmost position of the enclosure. Now, the panel from the factory sits approximately 130 millimeters from the rear wall to the surface of the mounting panel, about 5 inches. By moving it into its rearmost position, we can get that to within 50 millimeters, or roughly 2 inches, off of that rear wall, gaining 3 inches of additional depth. The other thing that we can do by putting in its rearmost position is to change the load bearing capacity from the factory position of 1126 pounds to 1351, gaining an additional 225 pounds on the panel. Go ahead and leave these black tabs down. Those are safety features until you're ready to move the panel. Then you just lift up on either one and slide the panel out. Now these are a toolless clip up here. I'm going to try to show you how to do it from above so you can see. You want to push this back down and then pinch the sides on the clip to remove it. Pull this out at a 90 and then bring this to as far back as it'll go. And you can see that the last pin is in the last hole position. And then this clip, this part will go in the back, this part goes into the middle, so it looks a little something like this. Put that in, and now we're going to do the same thing to the other side. And that's all there is to putting the top clips in, and we've moved them as far back as we can. I want to share something with you. So this is the mounting panel foot that's on the bottom of the panel. Notice it has a pin in it. So what happens is, as you slide the panel in on the rail, it bumps this bracket, see the bracket with the hole, and then when you stand it up, that pin aligns and locks into the hole in the bottom. That's the standard position. If we want to put it in the rearmost position, we don't even use these brackets. These brackets come out on either side, and you utilize the hole in the frame all the way back. So then, it's going to slide in like this, and it's going to seat into the hole in the frame. That's the rearmost position. Many people make the mistake of moving this bracket to here, thinking that's the rearmost position, and they can still go back even further. So I'm going to show you that next. These brackets are held in with a T25, so it's a Torx 25. self tapping screw, so I'm going to take these out completely. We don't need them. To put the panel in the rearmost position. Slide the panel all the way back until it bumps the frame. Stand it up, it should be locked in the bottom. I usually give it a little twist just to ensure it's locked in. And there we go. You want to put these safety blocks down. These little black wedges are safety features so then I can walk away from the panel. Don't ever walk away from the panel not having put those down. Next thing I want, I changed out my bit to a T30 because these fasteners for the mounting panel are T30s. Simply put those into place. Now I've got my panel installed in the rearmost position. 